Um, I'm so also very pleased to to present to present uh, Luis. Uh, most of you already met him and uh, and the uh, work he's doing for several years in Portugal and sometimes abroad uh, with his company, Luis Rebelo de Andrade, Rebelo de Andrade Arquitetos. Uh, it was the prize, Rafael Manzano Prize this year. So uh, no, no, no time for more presentation. I think he doesn't need it. Let's, um, let's, um, let's see what uh, he brings today. And uh, uh, Luis, very pleased to be here at Ordens Arquitetos. You're a very well-known Portuguese architect, as uh, as we all know. So, uh, thank you very much. Hi, everybody. First of all, I must thank you, uh, the first three speakers before me, all the speakers before me, because they they offer me some clues. We are we are working on a project in Mozambique. There are no uh, manufacturers and nobody to to do whatever we have to do. So we are thinking and we are working on creating a school there, so we can have people to to work on 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 this uh, project. But. Um, that's not what uh, brought me here. Let's uh, return to Europe and uh, to the work uh, I've been doing. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell a story, um, a story of a project that I'm working on, thirty years, um, and uh, a story that. Uh, I have a lot of little stories, and um, it's about uh, uh, a place. And uh, I, I brought you here something that we truly think that uh, knowing a place and its stories and uh, the way of people live the the place, it's not. Um, a simple detail that uh, we can avoid and uh, because um, we must know very well the place so we can have um, a construction that uh, anxious to be uh, uh, to survive to, um, uh, to to the future you know so um, this is my office in Lisbon. Now we are talking about Valle Brown, this project that I told you I'm working on uh, 30 years. This was the, the starting point of the, of the project. This was um, a very known farm in Douro Valle. Uh, it's a reference from people from there. It's... Um, that we start to, 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 in a competition, to transform this, this farm in a, in a, in a posada. Uh, uh, it's the, similar in Spain to a parador. It's a, a official uh, uh, projects from the state. And, uh, but, um, we won the competition, but uh, we never did. Uh, the, the, we never realized the, the, the project. Then uh, this, I, I bring you some photos from the story of the place and uh, some in front of uh, Rio Douro. And now, and then we had a. a it happened a fire on the on the on on. On the site, this uh, that uh, make um, this uh, we received the building like this. Then uh, someone bought this farm and uh, 
come to me to to make a project for an hotel that I started uh, in 2005 and um, and the challenge was that um, we have here about 3,500 square meters of building and the program uh, obliged us to build something about 2,000, uh, 22,000 uh, square meters on the site. So it was the first problem to 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 resolve because uh, if we we had to have a strategy to maintain the soul of the place because it's very difficult. Uh, in this change of uh, 3,000 to 22,000, it's very difficult to to guarantee that we maintain the soul of this starting point. That uh, what uh, uh, make that uh, the owner uh, get in love with this, and uh, we cannot, uh, we could not um, change this starting point. So. Um, uh, I started the project to license the project and um, I worked alone uh, with uh, my team to resolve the project and uh, we have uh, we made two projects landscape project and building project because the landscape was very it was fundamental to to turn this uh, building in something uh, that uh, could resist to the time, and um, and uh, we believe that um, the landscape could um, uh, hide a lot of construction on the site, and uh, so at, um, we we created the first uh, um, vertical gardens, and we work a lot with the. Uh, uh, something that we believe that it's um, it's uh, invisible architectural uh, buildings so this was the state of the of the, the building and uh, we made the project we made the project and we licensed the project and uh, the owner when we got the license the owner told me well we sh um, the constructor will be at the site next month so we we're going to start uh, doing it but i don't have any execution project it's uh, it's impossible you it's not uh, it's not feasible we don't have any execution project for the for the site and, and well it's your problem it's not mine uh, they will start it so uh, he made this project and uh, and Diogo uh, the contract that he made with the with the with the, the contractor was uh, a maximum price uh, cost for the for the project so we had a, a limit of costs that we 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 was obliged to 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 maintain so this project was made <clears throat> The execution project was made all in sight, uh, in sheet of papers. We created an amount of uh, sheet of papers with the details, and uh, and um, it was uh, the the place that inspired us, uh, the solutions and uh, and the constraints of the the, the costs uh, was uh, enormous, but uh, we have been able to to build this uh, in one year and a half and to make it uh, real now uh, it's it turns this uh, hotel i believe that um, i also believe that uh, we we have to to work with uh, all the local materials we are very fundamentalists on it. We uh, believe that um, one of the main problems in our days is the air condition, because the air condition gives us the possibility to build 
uh, bad to make bad construction because the air condition gives us the solutions to 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 fix what the construction doesn't so um, uh, and i think it's the cause of uh, a lot of uh, bad buildings that uh, we have to to live with them uh, so uh, the project returns this and uh, and uh, what can i say it's um, amazing and um, and it happens that uh, 12 years later this business uh, um, went in a bankrupt the, the hotel with the crisis and uh, and it was delivered this uh, to the banks and uh, a fund pick up the this this uh, this uh, uh, building and call me to transform this building in a in a six cents in a six cents hotel so i had the opportunity to return to this project it's um, amazing because um, after uh, uh, 15 years uh, we could uh, uh, we, we had the, the complete idea what went wrong, what went well and wrong, and so we could have the opportunity to fix what went well. Some Cesar Vieira used to say that uh, sometimes uh, there are projects that uh, we made with the right hand, but others, it's the left hand, so uh, it happens, and, uh, and uh, we must fix it. And I had the opportunity to fix, and uh, we are still working on it. After the, this uh, 30 years, we are con we continue to do things on the on the site. Now it's uh, the, the Aquapura, the the hotel. Uh, first change was the the main building. Uh, we transformed the um, the tennis court in a in a in a vegetable garden. It was a, a huge success. Now all the six cents around the world have a, a, a vegetable garden. This project is um, also amazing because uh, we normally we see the buildings from down to, to, to the top. And this building, we always see him from the top uh, because it's put it in a, in a valley and the main entrance of the hotel it's the last floor this building have eight floors and we we get in the building by the eighth floor of the building and we built some vertical gardens at the time uh, in 2008 we we made this, some experiences to 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 get uh, this uh, plantation in the facade. We covered the, the, the roofs sometimes with uh, the with, um, plantation. This is wanted to, to, um, to shit people in the, in the site. Uh, it looks like a vineyard because it, this is a place with a lot of vineyards on the site. So uh, uh, we wanted to to take out the, the typical roofs so we could um, hide a lot of construction on the site and to to make a, a good balance between building and 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 landscape this is the swimming pool we in the swimming pool we we uh, we use it was a hole in the land so you use all the the materials that from the demolitions to 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 get to put um, the the swimming pool in a highest highest position so and the original and uh, it, 
in our days what uh, this building is. At the time, it was a yellow building, and we gave this color so we could uh, also, with the color, um, integrate the building in the in the site um, because it's more land color in the site. This also, it's um, uh, a renovation of the the village. Now we're gonna start uh, work that in this uh, we're gonna put um, a green um, a greenhouse in, on on this um, uh, on this place and uh, and, uh, and uh, we're gonna transform uh, this is on working works this is a master plan of the the building. And now we're gonna uh, put uh, some more facilities in in the place. I am always defending that uh, for one square meter that we built, we must build uh, ten landscape um, uh, 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 vegetation and, uh, and and so on. And these are some. Uh, studies for the renovation of this uh, this area, mm. and uh, we're gonna um, this is what's uh, one thing that we we we're gonna start now to to do on on the site, uh, a greenhouse and uh, and. Uh, uh, new shape of the new swimming pool that um, we are obliged to 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 put on site so that's this thank you and um, i hope you like it okay. thank you very much luis uh, this is one of the uh, well-known uh, works uh, here in Portugal, in the north, it's near uh, Rio, near the R river Douro. Um, maybe you can ask now some questions about it or uh, any, any thoughts? Mm -hmm. Of course, people, local people. What is the relation today of local people with, the, with this hotel? Those are the, the, the best awards that I, I received on the on the, on, uh, on my life. That's uh, the the relation the, with people with the site, and uh, sometimes they they come to me and uh, they say thank you, Luis. Now we have. Uh, uh, fantastic place. This become a unique place because uh, it brought uh, people to the site. It's uh, balanced with uh, with uh, with uh, with the site, and uh, and that's a, a great award to to feel that people are uh, they like what happens there because uh, the. We are owners of the. We are owners of a site, but we are not owners of the landscape. The landscape is from everybody, and uh, we must work also um, uh, with uh, trying to understand uh, what people uh, uh, react to what we do in a in a site, because. Uh, we, had, uh, we have a relation with the owner, uh, the guy that pays us the work. We have a relation with the, with the municipality that uh, gives uh, the license to, but we must have something must, much more important that it's people, that uh, what they see in what we, we do and, uh, and what's the relation uh, that they, what they feel about, about uh, what we, we do. That's very important and that's the role of the architect. Yeah.